Hi, boys and girls. I'm at the dentist for a checkup to make sure I don't have any cavities. How's it looking there, Coach Rocco? I mean, Dentist Rocco? Up, oh, it's looking good so far, but hopefully you didn't eat too much Halloween candy like Jimmy does every year. Mmm, yum. Well, let's keep looking. All right, I'm just gonna look over here. That's looking good. How about this one over here? That one looks good. Uh, yeah, that looks good too. Up, uh, looking good, looking good. Congratulations, Ellie. You have no cavities. Looks like you've been brushing and flossing every day. Yep, twice a day. Once in the morning and once at night. Okay, Jimmy, now it's your turn. Uh, well, here's the thing. I already brushed my teeth this morning, so I don't need a checkup. Come on, let's go to class. Oh. Uh, don't be silly, Jimmy. Now, come on, this won't hurt a bit. You don't have to be scared. Scared? Me? This is Jimmy you're talking to, the bravest boy in class. Plus, I brought Mr. Fluffy for support. <laughs> scared, I'll show you who's scared. All right, let's have a look. Oh, uh, what is that tool you're using? On second thought, I'm out of here. Come on, Mr. Fluffy. Wait, Jimmy, I wasn't done. He's always running away. This happens every year at Jimmy's checkup, but don't worry. He left his Halloween candy here. We can use it to lure him back. Jimmy's gonna get his checkup whether or not he wants to or not. <laughs> <laughs> if you wanna help find Jimmy, hit that thumbs up button. Let's go, turn to Rocco. Jimmy, come out, come out, wherever you are. Jimmy, I have your Halloween candy here. If you come out and do your checkup, you can have all your Halloween candy back. Jimmy? Coming through, coming through. I have the perfect plan to catch Jimmy. What do you think? Whoa, a giant beach ball? No, it's a giant hamster ball. I went ahead and put Jimmy's Halloween candy inside. See it right there. And when he comes by to get it, we'll hide and then we'll sneak up and wham, we got him. <laughs> what do you think? Well, Jimmy would do anything for his Halloween candy, so I think this is a great idea. Come on, let's go hide. Come on, this way. <laughs> this is gonna be so easy. I'm like the best hide and seek player in the whole world. Ellie and Dentist Rocco don't stand a chance. <gasps> Hey, look at that. Mm -hmm. It looks like a giant hamster ball. Oh, he's coming. It is a giant hamster ball. And hey, look, some of my candy's inside too. This must be my lucky day. <laughs> get him, get him, get him, Coach Gotcha, Rocco. Jimmy. <laughs> oh no, Ellie and Dentist Rocco. <laughs> oh, I guess you got me. This is a great plan, Coach Rocco. Jimmy would do anything for his candy. Yep, now we just gotta pump you up and get you back to the dentist's office. Come on. And just one more pump, Jimmy, and I'll sit. Awesome, this way to the office, Jimmy, come on. <laughs> right this way. That was some great teamwork, Dr. Rocco. Wait a second, I have an idea. <laughs> Usually it's right. so hard to get. Jimmy! 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 Jimmy, get back here! He can't catch me! Hey! Oh, ah, ah, oh, oh. Coach! I mean, dentist! I, yes! Jimmy! Keep going! Don't worry about me! Wahaha! <laughs> Jimmy escapes again. They have no shot of finding me. No dentist appointment for Jimmy this year. To celebrate, I'm gonna take a nice, relaxing dip in the pool. Whoa. Hey, wait a second. Is that more candy? Wow, this really is my lucky day. Not only do I not have to go to my dentist appointment, but I get to eat the rest of my candy too. Yes! Let's dive in and get it. Here comes Jimmy. Got it. Ah. Gotcha! Oh, no. <laughs> no running away this time, Jimmy. All right, Jimmy.
me? Come on out of the pool. You can play hide and seek all day after your checkup. All right, fine. I just need you to help me out. All right, here, grab hold of this toothbrush. Careful, Coach Rocco. Closer. Now, Jimmy, get closer to me. Wait, Jimmy. Jimmy, Jimmy. Get closer to me. Help me, Oh, wait. This is also doubles as a flotation device. Oh, great. So, oh, good. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh Kyle, oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, God. Oh. Don't fall in. Why does this keep happening to me? <laughs> Couldn't catch me at school, or in the hamster ball, or even in the pool. <laughs> I'm the best at hiding. You know, sometimes even I forget how awesome I am. And speaking of, here comes the Jimmy Spinneroony. Whoa! Did I make it? Yes! And the crowd goes wild. Jimmy, 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 Jimmy! Oh no, Ellie and Dentist Rocco. Wait, uh, you want me to teach you how to do the Jimmy Spinneroony? Nope, Jimmy, we finally caught you. And it's time for you to get your checkup, once and for all. Oh, fine. I eat all my Halloween candy anyway. So I probably have a lot of cavities. Let's just get this over with. All right, let's have a look-see. Uh... Now what's this over here? Oh, looks like you got a little, uh... Halloween candy stuck up there. Not too good. Uh, what's this over here? Oh, need to floss that later. Uh-huh. Oh, looks like you got an old uh, gummy bear stuck between those teeth there. What's this over here? Over here, uh-huh, looking good. Little gummy bear right there. There we go, look at that. Looking good. Well, guess what, Jimmy? You've got no cavities. No cavities, awesome. The old Jimmy Chompers are back in business, better than ever. <laughs> I told you, Jimmy, checkups aren't so bad after all. <laughs> yes! Well, when you're a big boy like me, they're pretty easy. And especially now that I'm done, I get to do another ah! terrific Jimmy <laughs> Spinneroni. Oh. Jimmy! <laughs> I think I broke my tooth. Oh, Jimmy. Oh, no, Jimmy. Hey, Sparkle Squad. Today we're going to hit the pool. And Camp Counselor Coach Rocco told us to make these giant shapes. But they're a lot heavier than I thought. I'm definitely going to need some help. Oh, hey, Jimmy. Do you want to help me carry this giant shape over to the pool? Sure thing. My name is Jimmy, you know, the strongest kid in camp. This will be a breeze. <sighs> I wonder what these giant shapes are for. Hey, do you hear that? It sounds like the ice cream truck. Oh, ice cream? Um, why don't we go get a cone after our camp activity today, Jimmy? <laughs> oh, after our camp activity? But I want it now. I can't wait. Ice cream. <laughs> Jimmy! <laughs> no! <laughs> uh, I guess I'm going to have to carry this all by myself. <laughs> Today's challenge is jumping through impossible shapes. The rules are simple. We're going to take these shapes that you made and put them into the pool. Then each of you are gonna jump into the pool and through the shape. The one who jumps through the shape and doesn't touch the board gets a point. But if you touch the board, you get zero. Now we're gonna use this wheel to pick which shape we use first. Ready? One, two, three, spin the wheel! <laughs> yes, it landed on circle. Well, oh. here's the circle. Ellie, would you do the honor and throw it into the pool? My pleasure, Coach Rocco. So I have to jump into the circle without touching the sides of it. I think this is going to be pretty easy, don't you? <laughs> I have my GoPro just in case I want to see what it looks like when I jump in. Bye! Ooh, it's going to look so cool. And I got my goggles. Let's put them on. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> Perfect! Swoosh! <laughs> All right, Jimmy, now it's your 
turn. <laughs> Jimmy? Over here, coach. This challenge is super easy, so that's why I'm gonna make it awesome with my favorite donut floaty. It's a perfect circle, so it'll fit right through the board. Oh Ready or not, here comes Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy. Did I do it? Did I do it? Did I win? Oh no, Jimmy, you didn't make it through. That crack you heard oh. was you crashing through the board. You didn't make it through at all. Wait a minute, I didn't make it through? Hold on, I get a do-over. Just let me get my donut. Oh, look at this, Jimmy. Okay, and the score for round one is one Ellie, Jimmy zero. And now it's time for round two. And spin the wheel! <laughs> it landed on the person! Oh, wait till you see this one. This one's my personal favorite. <laughs> A person? It looks like he's sleeping. How are we supposed to jump through this if he's sleeping? <laughs> Throw. Jimmy's definitely got this one. I just gotta jump in there like I'm jumping into bed. Here comes Jimmy. Jimmy. I did it. I definitely got it this time, right? You did it, Jimmy. You jumped right through without touching the board. Great job. That was amazing. Amazing! Awesome! <laughs> this was the hardest jump ever and Jimmy got it! Woo! Nice jump, Jimmy! Now let's see if I can get through without touching the sides. This is gonna be a hard one! One, two, three, go! Ah! you touch the board that means no point for you but that does mean that you and jimmy are now tied oh i love a good competitive challenge <laughs> and now it's time for round three ellie has one jimmy has one the score is tied now let's spin the wheel <laughs> Wow, it landed on the letter B. We have to jump through shapes and letters. Yup, and here it is. Lucky for me, this is what my name starts with. Oh, I'm totally gonna win this one. Jimmy, your name starts with a J, not B, remember? J, Jimmy. J, B, what's the difference? Either way, I'm totally gonna win. <laughs> yeah. This is a tricky one. I'm gonna have to pick which loop I'm gonna have to jump through. I can pick the nearest one or the furthest one. I think I'm gonna pick the furthest one. I'm feeling extra jumpy today. Three, two, one. you could do the same? Ellie only jumped through one of the loops in the B. That's like cheating. I'm gonna jump through both loops and that'll show you who the real best jumper is. Here comes Jimmy. Jimmy. I'm afraid you don't get a point for this one. I'm not allowed to touch the board? 
Nobody told me that. That's not fair. I thought it was better if you touched the board. Oh, come on, give me a do-over. Let me go one more time, coach, please. Not fair. And the score is now two Ellie, one Jimmy. It's time for round four. And spin the wheel! <gasps> awesome! It landed on the heart shape! That's my favorite shape of all time! A oh, heart? <laughs> Yuck! Uh, give me that. Favorite shape? Check. Jump and stretch. Check. Time for me to go! One, two, three! Oh, look at that perfect jump! <laughs> okay, pressure's on, Jimmy, but you can't get through. Please, heart shape is easy peasy. All I gotta do is turn myself into a heart shape. Ready or not, here comes Jimmy! Oh. Ah! <laughs> at going down the mega slide, but let's see how good you are at going down the mega slide and through the impossible shape. Impossible shapes? How are we supposed to do that? You're gonna use your skill to slide down the slide through the impossible shape without breaking this board. Well, let's see if I can do it. Three, two, one, go! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I did it! I did it! Okay, Jimmy, it's your turn. Time to show you how an expert slider does it. Let's go! Go! Awesome! Right through! You're supposed to go straight through without breaking the board. What? You didn't tell me that. It's not fair. Oh. I'm ready for round two. You're gonna like this shape. Do you recognize it? It's E for Ellie. <laughs> ready to go? She did it again. Well done. <laughs> okay, Jimmy, your turn. All right. Here comes Jimmy. I did it. I got it. Right through. Actually, your head did touch the board right there. It kind of broke a little. But no, it didn't. No. Actually, I guess now that you mention it, my head is kind of sore. Let's go to the instant replay. Now it's time for round three. Awesome. Here's our shape. Pizza shaped. Uh, well, it's actually a triangle, but uh, it is the hardest because it gets narrower up here. So watch out, Ellie. Okay. I think I got this one in the back. Three, two, 
you maybe, but not for Jimmy. <laughs> I got this one down. For pizza! Here we go! Oh! Oh! Whoa, Jimmy! Oh, oh, oh. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Let, let me try one more try. Uh, I got it this time. I don't think so. Here comes Jimmy! Oh! Wow! Ah! Did I win? Uh. Does it look like you won? Not quite. You know what? Enough of this game. I'm gonna go have some real pizza. Come on, Jimmy. Actually, you know what? Pizza sounds kind of good. Yeah. See ya, Coach Rocco. Oh, well, save some for me. I'm hungry, too. Guess what, everyone? I'm gonna get up to some super slip and slidey fun with Jimmy and Coach Rocco. And we're gonna crash into these pins. <laughs> I love bowling and slip and slide. <laughs> All right, kids, are you ready for today's activities? Okay. Yeah. All right, you get two chances. What's up, Sparkle Squad? It's my favorite time of the year, Halloween. And this year, I'm dressed up as Firefighter Ellie. By the time I'm done trick-or-treating, this bag will be all filled with candy. <laughs> House number one, let's do this. Let's see what yummy treat they have for us. Trick-or-treat. Oh, wow, cool costume. <laughs> I love Minecraft. So, Ellie, do you know who I am? Hmm, let me guess. Coach Rocco? Wrong! It's me, Jimmy. I tricked you. <laughs> you definitely tricked me, Jimmy. Good one. Hey, what are you doing? It's called trick or treat, Ellie. And since I tricked you, that means I get to take one of your treats. Oh, this is awesome! A full-size Snickers bar. Best Halloween ever. Wait a minute, so you're saying that I have to trick you to get candy? I've never heard of these rules before. Well, that's how it works, but uh, don't count on tricking me. I've never been tricked before, and I don't plan on it happening this year. Guess you'll just have to try again next year. Happy Halloween! Jimmy! Oh, hmm, he says he's never been tricked before? Ha! We'll see about that. Boys and girls, if you want to see Jimmy get tricked, give me a big thumbs up. I'm going to get that candy, Jimmy. Jimmy's always making up rules during the holidays. Huh. He always does this every single time. I wonder what I can do to trick him. Hi, Coach Rocco. What are you doing? Uh, just doing some laundry. Hey, firefighter. That's the best costume I've seen all day. Put out any fires lately? <laughs> Thanks, Coach Rocco. I like this costume, too. It's my favorite. But Jimmy knew it was me right away, and he has a rule now that if he knows who I am in my costume, that means he gets to take my candy, and I can't have any candy. I never heard of that. Well, I got plenty of clothes and costumes here. We could trick Jimmy all day. I had the perfect thing. Ooh. Try that. Yes. <laughs> oh, and one more thing. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Coach Rocco. I'm going to get so much candy. <laughs> Yeehaw! Howdy, partners. It's me, Cowboy Ellie. Wow, Coach Rocco sure has a lot of interesting costumes. I think I'm going to definitely trick Jimmy this time. Another trick-or-treater. Here's my chance to get more candy. They'll never know it's me. Trick-or-treat! Well, hey there, Mr. Cowboy. But first, can you guess who I am? Hmm, well, I reckon you're Jimmy, ain't ya? What? How did you know it was me? <clears throat> well, I bet I can guess who you are, too. Let's oh, yeah? See. You got your hat, your mustache, and a horsey. Now, what's your horsey's name? Uh, my horsey's name? My horsey's name's Horsey Rocco. That's it. Rocco the horse. Horsey Rocco, huh? Mm -hmm. Nice try. I knew it was you all along, Coach Rocco. <laughs> what? Ellie, 
I thought you were Coach Rocco. Nope, you thought I was Coach Rocco, but I was Cowboy Ellie the entire time. Oh, very funny. Well, newsflash, I only let you in. And that's just because I felt bad about taking your Snickers bar, which I'm gonna eat right now. Yeah, right, not so fast. This candy bar is mine because you got tricked. <laughs> Maybe I'll come by later and trick you again. <laughs> trick or treat, happy Halloween, Jimmy. Yeah, right. Jimmy never gets tricked twice. I'm not letting that happen again. And fell for the Grandpa Sparkles costume? <laughs> I know! My trick-or-treat basket is so full already! Do you have any more costumes that I can wear? Uh, we're getting low here, but I think I have something. Nope, we've tricked Jimmy so many times we've used up all the costumes. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Hmm, I want to trick him one last time. What do we do? <gasps> Coach Rocco, do you have that cowboy costume from earlier still? Yeah, it's right here. Okay, and do you think that your shirt would fit me? This? Yeah, why? <laughs> Follow me. I have an idea for the greatest Halloween trick yet. Howdy, I'm Cowboy Ellie. <laughs> and I'm Coach Rocco. <laughs> nice t-shirt, I like it. Thank you. really you. think he's gonna fall for this? <laughs> oh, I think so. <laughs> Let me just put on my glasses and fix your hat a little bit. Okay. Trick or treat! Trick or treat! <laughs> Coach Rocco, what are you doing trick or treating? How come you didn't wear a costume? Wait a second. Something looks different about you. Oh, new sunglasses. <laughs> Super cool, Coach. And uh, who's your friend here? Oh, that's funny. This is the second cowboy that's trick-or-treated at my house tonight. In fact, you look similar. Same hat, same mustache, same horsey. Hmm, what's your horsey's name? Uh, uh, uh Rocco? <laughs> Rocco the horsey, huh? Nice try, but you gotta get up pretty early in the morning to pull one over Jimmy's head. I know it's you, Ellie Sparkles. Coach oh, Rocco! <laughs> What are you doing? I thought you were... Wait a minute, if you're Coach Rocco... Howdy! Then who are you? It's me! Ellie Coach! <laughs> Ellie Coach? No, oh, you got me again? <laughs> Trick or treat! Is this where we get all the candy? Yeah. Oh, oh, these are my favorite! Do you have any candy corns, Jimmy? <laughs> Those are my all-time favorite! I put them underneath my pillow and they get nice and soft and when I wake up in the morning, I just pop one in my head! <laughs> oh, my teeth are killing me, my teeth. Happy Halloween, Sparkle Squad! I am so excited for this year because I get to give out all the candy to the people in the neighborhood! I have a huge bowl that I filled up with all sorts of wonderful treats. I can't wait to see all the costumes. They're gonna be so cool. <laughs> oh, it's our first trick or treater already. I wonder who it is. <gasps> trick or treat. Hi, Jimmy. Oh, cool crayon costume. That's super creative. Thanks, Ellie. I got the coolest costume in school, per usual, so I can get the most candy. Well, lucky for you, I just filled up my bowl with all sorts of treats. Wow, these are gigantic. I'll take this one and this one, my favorite. And this one, I love these too, and uh, no thanks. Ooh, candy, 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 candy. Oh, but Jimmy, because they're full-size bars, you can only pick one. 
to keep it fair for everyone else, I gotta have some more for the rest of the kids. Only one? Are you sure? Can I have just a couple more? Nope, but I promise you, Jimmy, if I have any leftover candy, we'll share it together. No. Oh. Wait a second. Sure thing, Ellie. Whatever you say, fair's fair after all. I guess I'll just take this one and be on my way. Happy Halloween. Oh. Well, that was easy. I'm really glad that Jimmy respected my rule of one candy per person. <laughs> trick or treat. Huh, another trick or treater? That was really fast. Trick or treat. Hmm, Jimmy, I know that's you. You just put on glasses and a green crayon costume instead of your blue one. Oh, come on, Ellie. You're the only one in this whole block that gives out full bars. Don't I at least get points for trying a new costume? Jimmy, I'll see you tomorrow at school, and I already told you I'll give you candy if I have any left over. Oh, Ellie, please. Come oh, on. Jimmy. Give me some of that sweet candy. Jimmy. Candy, candy, candy. Come on, Ellie. Tomorrow, I'll give, give you leftovers to tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> Coach Rocco, Coach Rocco, hey, hey, there you are. <laughs> Ellie's giving out full bars of candy to the trick-or-treaters, but to get another one, I have to change my costume. Do you have anything I could use? Oh, well, let's see here. Um, no luck, Jimmy. These are all double costumes, so you'll need a friend to wear it with you. A friend? That's perfect. We can go together. Oh, no. I haven't been uh, trick-or-treating in a long time. Coach Rocco, I'm telling you, these candy bars what? are huge. You've got to join me. That big, huh? Well, let's see what we got here. This ought to do the trick. <laughs> perfect. Ooh, some lucky person is going to be getting Reese's sticks. I haven't even had these before. And Hershey's with almonds. Oh, I'm so excited. I haven't trick-or-treated in years. Now remember, your ketchup, I mustard. And if anyone asks, this is our first time being here. Okay, all right, all right. Kit Kats. Ooh, ooh, peanut butter cups. Classic. Trick -or so good. Oh, <laughs> Trick or treat! Oh, hi! <laughs> Ketchup and mustard! That's a super funny costume! Oh, hi, Coach Rocco! Oh, you know it was me? <laughs> yeah, of course! Oh, well, you always go as ketchup for Halloween. Oh, that's true. Well, Coach Rocco's back trick or treating. <laughs> I'm ready for some yummy treats! <laughs> and who did you bring? Who's your friend here, Mr. Mustard? Huh? Oh, thank you. I'll put this on my hot dogs. Oh, let's play a game. Why don't you close your eyes and reach into the bowl and whatever you pick out is the candy that you keep. Oh, okay, I'll go first. <laughs> All right, I love games. It's a huge candy bar, best Halloween ever. <laughs> my turn. <laughs> okay. Oh, you got a banana! You're gonna have a healthy Halloween! It looks delicious and it matches your costume! Yeah! <laughs> well, you ready to hit some more houses, Mr. Mustard? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, no. happy Halloween, you guys! I hope you get tons of candy from the other houses. You're only allowed one treat here. I gotta save the rest for everybody else! <laughs> Bye, Ellie! Happy Bye. Halloween! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was nice, wasn't it? I wonder who that Mr. Mustard was. Great teamwork, Jimmy. You were right, these candy bars are huge. <laughs> Great for you. You got a candy bar. All I got was this banana. Nobody wants a fruit on Halloween. I think since it was my idea, we should trade. Uh, I don't think so. In all my days of trick-or-treating, I've never seen candy bars this huge. Look, it's as big as your head. <laughs> Sweet, delicious, chocolatey candy goodness. That's it, Coach. We have to go back there and try again. I gotta get one of those candy bars. Do you have any other costumes? Well, I do have one costume left, but I don't think you're gonna like it. What? No way. Uh-uh. How are we even gonna fit into that? I don't think so, Coach. Trick or treat! Trick or treat! <laughs> wow, a horsey! <laughs> 
It looks so real. <gasps> and there's two people in the costume? That's awesome. You put so much work into it. And because you put so much work into your Halloween costume, you can have the rest of my candy. Ooh. Well, I have an orange and I have this huge candy bar. So who wants the orange? No. Mm. No? Then who wants the candy bar? Oh, me, 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 me. I want it. No, I want it. You got the last one. You should get the orange, Jimmy. Orange is your favorite color. Coach Rocco, it's my turn to get a candy. Oh, no. 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 <laughs> Jimmy, Coach Rocco, it was you two in the horse costume. How many times have you been trick-or-treating here today? The jig is up. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy, Coach Rocco. Oh, well, I guess this is all for me then. And <laughs> I get a free horse head. They left all their candy here too. So silly. Wow! there's a present out here. Hey, Jimmy, have you been leaving your toys out in the yard again? No, -uh, not me, I swear. Hey, it looks like there's a trail of presents. I say we follow them. Good idea. Hmm. Hmm. Jimmy, could that really be him? Santa's hat, Santa's coat, and that's the real Santa. It's him. <laughs> there, there, Rudolph. Calm down. A nice pat on the head always made me feel better. <laughs> In fact, I'll pat myself right now. Ouchie! I really hurt myself when I ran into that branch over there. <laughs> Santa hit his head. I don't think he remembers that it's Christmas. Come on, we should probably help him out. Let's see if he's okay. Hey Santa, shouldn't you get out of the pool? It's almost Christmas time. Christmas? I love Christmas. I can't wait to see what the Easter Bunny has brought for me. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay? All right, let's give you a fun quiz to see if you're ready for Christmas Eve. So, where do you live? Hawaii with all my reindeer. Ho, 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 ho. No, Santa, you live in the North Pole with Mrs. Claus. The North Pole? I never heard of it. Is that near Hawaii? Hold on, let's try another question. Okay, Santa, what do you do every year on Christmas Eve? Oh, Christmas Eve, that's easy. I uh, watch a lot of TV, I play Roblox, and then I... Or sleep on the couch eating a bag of popcorn. Ho, ho, ho. No, Santa, you deliver all the presents to the boys and girls on Christmas Eve. Jimmy, this is way worse than I thought. He's forgotten everything about Christmas. You know what? I think I have a great idea. Santa, Santa school. school! Boys and girls, if you want to go to Santa school with the real Santa Claus, give us a big thumbs up. <laughs> okay, we'll see you inside, Santa. All right. <laughs> Come on, Rudolph! <laughs> Welcome to your first day of Santa school. Santa helpers Ellie and Jimmy at your service. Now the first lesson is we have to change into your Santa costume. The first thing you're going to need is your big red cozy coat. It's how everyone recognizes you. You mean Santa doesn't wear a Hawaiian shirt? Oh. Well, this is cozy, though. <laughs> <laughs> Santa also doesn't wear sunglasses. <laughs> he needs his reading glasses so he can read his naughty and nice list. Oh, yes. That is much better. <laughs> Don't forget your famous Santa hat. Oh, this. Now this is familiar. I know what's going on here. Ho, 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 ho. We're celebrating a birthday party. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> no, it's not anybody's birthday, Santa. Anyway, Santa also needs to have his big black belt. Do you know where this goes, Santa? Oh, yes, this one I do know. It goes right here at top of my head. There you go. Oh, no, this is going to be the longest day of school ever. 
All right, Santa, it's time for your next lesson, music class. We're going to teach you to sing one of the most famous Christmas songs there is. Oh, don't worry about this one, Jimmy, I got it. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. No, Santa, not the itsy bitsy spider, it's Jingle Bells. Now, here, Ellie will sing it to you. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey! Uh, smirkle there, smirkle there, smirkle there, smirkle there. No, 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 Santa. Repeat after me. Jingle. Jingle. Bells. Bells. Jingle bells. Smirkle there. No, 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 no. I see what you're doing wrong. Now, let's take this slowly. Jingle. Jingle. Bells. Bells. Now put it together and say jingle bells. <laughs> oh. oh no, this plan isn't working. We're going to have to regroup and find out another plan to save Christmas. Be right back, Santa. What the heck's a smirkle there anyway? Smirkle there, smirkle there, smirkle, smirkle there. <laughs> smirkle. <laughs> there. Oh. What's your name? Santa, you're going to learn one of the most important lessons of the day. You're going to learn how to put the presents underneath the Christmas tree without waking anybody up. And I'll show you how to do it. First, you gotta take your presents, then you gotta carefully glide through all these lasers, dodging them, and make sure you're as quiet as possible. Because if you touch even one of these lasers or make too big of a sound, the Christmas alarm will go off. And we don't want that to happen. Let's see. And clear. Well done, Jimmy. <laughs> See, Santa? Super easy. Remember, nice and quiet. Got it. Nice and quiet. Here goes. Oh. This is hard work. Do you have any snacks around here? Yeah. Santa, why don't you eat your milk and cookies that I got for you? And I'll be over there thinking about your next lesson. Milk and cookies. I've never had that before. Hmm. It actually tastes kind of familiar. Of course, milk and cookies is my favorite snack. <laughs> I remember now. I remember. <laughs> Coming through, coming through. Santa's got gifts to deliver. Ho, 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 ho. Santa? Piece of cake. Yeah. Ho, 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 ho. This is fun. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 ho. I feel like a spry spring chicken. <laughs> ho, 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 piece of cake. Santa, you did it. You passed through without triggering any alarms. I think you passed Santa school. Just one more question to make sure you're back to normal. What is Santa's favorite Christmas song? Good question, Jimmy. 
Could it be? Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Ha, 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 ha. Merry Christmas. Ha, ha, ha. What's up, Sparkle Squad? Me and Jimmy have been playing a lot this morning, and now we're super hungry. I wonder what we're going to have for lunch today. Oh, maybe we can get some pizza. Ooh, that's a great idea. Hey, Coach, can we get some pizza for takeout? Takeout? Look at all the food that's in here. We have a lot of food that needs to get used up. So how about we make some lunchtime smoothies? Ooh. You can make an orange smoothie. You can make a red smoothie. You each could use five ingredients. And um, let's see who makes the best one. Jimmy, you're going to get beat. Awesome, an orange smoothie? That's my favorite color, so there's no way I'm losing this challenge. <laughs> Wait a second, what's orange? Coach Rocco, there's no food that's orange. This is impossible, aw, oh, come on. Hmm, let's see. Here's some oranges. Of course. Let's plop a couple in there. Baby carrots. I know what this needs. Cheetos, my favorite. Mm. Cheetos? Yum. Hmm, I know what it's missing. Mac and cheese. That's kind of orange. The cheese, at least. Yum. This is going to be the cheesiest so smoothie good. ever. <laughs> hmm, let's see what else we got in the fridge. Mustard's kind of orange, right? Close enough, I'd say. <laughs> Little mustard on it. This smells good already. Let's blend it up. Okay. <laughs> and... <laughs> All right, let's pour it out. Got the cup ready? Mm-hmm. Smells delicious. <laughs> oh, that looks scrumptious. How about we split it three ways? Uh, On you second can thought. Go first, coach. Yeah, you can be the taste tester. Oh, all right, all right. More for me. <laughs> mm, this smells interesting. Mm. Oh, oh. Is it coach? No, it's, um, it's, um, a little gritty. <laughs> Must be the carrot. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> but it's delicious and nutritious, Coach. You gotta love it. Yeah, yes, um, um, excuse me a second. <laughs> All right, I still need yours, Ellie. <laughs> no problem. I think he loved it. Poor Coach Rocco. Hmm, now I have to make my smoothie. Put in some apples, some strawberry jelly. There's not much in there. There is this tomato sauce. Tomatoes are fruit. Mmm, I love strawberry jelly. You know, Ellie, I don't think that's quite red enough. Let's get another ingredient. Mm. It's good on pizza. Surely it'll be just as good in a smoothie. You know what? Let's just throw a couple. I'm not so sure about this, Jimmy. Well, to top it off and make it perfect, I found some hot sauce to give it a little spice, you know? Oh, there you go. There we go. Oh, that was a lot of hot sauce, Jimmy. The more the merrier. Okay, time to blend. I feel much better, and I'm a little bit hungry. So, um, would you like it? You're Taste gonna love it, it Coach. No, it's no, no, I'm good. Oh, all, right, all, all for you, Coach. Bottoms up. <laughs> it's a little bit spicy, isn't it? It's, uh, 
I need, I need some, I need to have water, water, I need to have yes. Oh gosh. Here, I'll just drink this. Oh. Oh, that's your, that's your smoothie. Oh God. Oh God. Yes, yes, yes. How about we have um, ice cream for lunch today, yes? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh God. Hey coach. Look who I found. Time to wake up! I'm up, I'm up! Oh, oh hi, Coach Rocco. I was just having the best dream. You should have seen it. You've overslept again the fifth time this camp. You're gonna have to learn to follow directions. Oh, Coach Rocco, Jimmy will follow directions just fine. Today, we're gonna try a new activity, the Say Yes Challenge. Yeah. Jimmy, you're gonna have to say yes to Ellie for the next 24 hours. What? Anything but that. Coach Rocco, I'm sorry, but Ellie's right. I won't sleep in again. Come on, tell him, Ellie. So let me get this right. Jimmy has to say yes to everything I ask him for the next day? Yes! In that case, I think that Jimmy could actually learn a little lesson. <laughs> oh, come on. Best day ever. More like worst day ever. <laughs> Oh, Jimmy, am I glad to see you. Can you help me blow up these pool floats? What? No way. I was just about to go for a swim. That's crazy. You do remember what Coach Rocco said about saying yes to me all day. No. <laughs> so I'll take that as a yes? Yes, Ellie. Perfect. You did great. Now I'm going to go inside, and I'll see you later. Remember, no playing. Yeah, remember, no playing. Those are the drinks. <laughs> I feel dizzy already. Look how big this thing is. You need the lungs of an elephant to blow all these up. Time for a shortcut. Awesome. See how much quicker that was? This is why Jimmy's the smartest kid in camp. Hey, wait a second. This gives me an idea. to be blowing up the floats. I am not Jimmy. I'm a giant hamster. <laughs> ha ha. I get it, Jimmy. You're a hamster in a hamster ball. But you said that you were supposed to blow up these floats. Now, come on. Sorry, but I don't think I can blow up anything while I'm in here. That is, unless you think you can catch me. Come and get me, Ellie. So you're saying we're going to play tag, and if I catch you, you're finally going to blow them up? Yep. Fine. You're on. Oh, I'm going to have so many floats for you to blow up by the time I catch you. Ooh. Hey, Jimmy. That was a great game of tag. Oh, and well done on blowing up all these floats. Oh, thanks, Ellie. Yeah, super fun. Well, after that, I'm exhausted. Well, I'm gonna go make some lunch. Oh, that's a great idea. You know what? I'm getting hungry, too. Hey, how about making me something to eat as well? You know I have to say <laughs> yes to you all day, so yes, I'll make you something to eat. But lucky for me, I happen to love cooking. In fact, I'm the best chef in the whole camp. I didn't know you liked to cook, Jimmy. Okay, Mr. Chef, why don't you make me something delicious? Something you think I'll like. Perfect. One Ellie special coming right up. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. What can Chef Jimmy make Ellie? 
Well, I always see her drinking those green smoothies. And there's a blender right here. Maybe I'll make her my own green smoothie. Hmm, what ingredient should we use first? It's gotta be something green and healthy. Let's see what they got in here. Spinach, perfect. Delicious, nutritious, and most importantly, green. No, I think we need something greener. How about a little seaweed, fresh from the ocean? Yum, yum, it's starting to smell good already. Hmm, but we should add some fruit. I don't know if we have any though. I got it, fruity gummy worms. It's the next best thing. And these are some of my favorite candies. And hmm, let's get a little more liquid in there. I got it, some pickle juice. Complete with pickles, of course. Awesome. And as a special finishing touch to get those big camper muscles, an egg. This is gonna be so good. Let's blend it up. Yum, all done and it smells delicious. Let's pour it out. Mmm, ah, perfect. Oh, Ellie, I finished your smoothie. Oh, wow, Jimmy, thanks. Wow, how did you know I love a green smoothie? It gives me all the energy I need for camp activities. Yep, and this has fruit in it and veggies and even a few special Chef Jimmy secret ingredients. Ooh. Oh, Jimmy, what did you put in here? It kind of smells like a camp garbage can. Yeah. Thank you so much, but I think I'll pass. Mm, it's super green, just how you like it. Oh, is that one of those healthy smoothies you're always drinking, Ellie? Here you go, Coach Rocco. Try it. It's delicious and nutritious. Mm. Coach, I wouldn't drink that if I were... Mm. Oh, no! Oh. Oh. Mmm, interesting <laughs> and tangy <laughs> and a bit uh, chewy. <laughs> You're right, Jimmy. I, I feel an energy boost coming on. <laughs> Coach, are you okay? I'm just going to go with that. Vacuum the lawn. <laughs> Okay, bye, Coach. Glad you liked it. Have fun vacuuming the lawn. I told you it was good. All right, campers, as you may know, tonight is the biggest night of camp yet. The Roblox Tournament of Champions. Yes! yes! Roblox, Roblox Tournament. Tournament! Awesome! But there'll be no Roblox playing as long as this camp is such a mess. So I'm gonna need you two campers to get this place in tip-top shape. I mean, this place has to be spotless. Don't worry, Coach Rocco. We'll get this place clean in no time. Yep, don't you worry. Ellie will clean the whole place up. <laughs> That's the spirit. I mean it. Keep this room clean. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I'm gonna go to my room to practice Roblox for the tournament. See ya. Wait a second, Jimmy. Stay right here. We have to get this place clean before you can practice. I'll tell you what. Why don't you? Set up this tent for outdoor camping. I mean, can you set up this tent? You do remember the challenge rules, don't you? Yes, I remember the rules. Okay, fine, I'll take care of the tent, but after that I'm going up to my room to practice. Deal? Deal. Just because I have to say yes to Ellie all day, she thinks that she's the boss. Well, I'll show her who the real boss at camp is. You know what? Change of plans. Tonight we're gonna camp indoors instead of outdoors. <laughs>
All done. Wow, this is even cooler than I thought. Coach Rocco and Ellie gotta see this. Hey coach, Ellie, come on, you gotta see this. This is why I'm the best camper ever. <laughs> He's gonna love this. Ta-da! What do you think? It's a... Uh... Is this a tent? In the room that I told you to keep spotless? In the room I was gonna win the Roblox championship. Don't worry, Coach Rocco. Um, Jimmy and I will clean this up in no time. It's just a couple tables, a couch, and we can take this all outside. It'll be so easy. <laughs> Don't worry. Yep, yep, in no time, just like Ellie said. Mm -hmm. Well, that's the camp spirit, just like I taught you. <laughs> all right, I'll see you campers later. Have a blast. <laughs> Phew. I thought Coach Rocco was gonna be mad at me. Well, thanks a lot, Ellie, I owe you one. Yeah, you definitely do, Jimmy. Hey, what about one more day of you saying yes to me? That should do it. What? No, not in a million years. <laughs> Please, Ellie, anything but that. No way. <sighs> hey, Sparkle Squad. We were supposed to go outside for camp activities today. But it's raining outside. I hate rain, it ruins everything. Awesome! It's raining outside? I love it when it rains. That means no camp activities today. It's like a snow day at school. I can do whatever I want all day. Rain dance time. <laughs> Not so fast, Jimmy. We don't have any snow days or rain days here at Coach Rocco's camp. So since we can't do any activities outside, we're gonna do something inside. The last to leave your bedroom challenge. What? what? Bedroom? You cannot take a step outside of your bedroom all day. And to make things more interesting, I'm going to give you each $200 to buy things online. But make sure you only buy things to help you with your challenge. Here's your tablets. There you go. Start shopping! <laughs> yes, my package finally came! Let's see what I got. I picked some really awesome things, just you wait and see. The first thing is... Yes, my Robux gift card for $50! Look at that! Oh man, with this $50, I can finally get into the VIP server for Meep City. And I can get the French braid for my avatar. <laughs> I can play Roblox all day. And now for the coolest room in the whole house, Jimmy's room. I ordered this huge box of stuff online, but honestly, I don't even really need it. I can stay in my bedroom all day anyway. All I need is my bed and my basketball. Now, can Ellie do that? I don't think so. Let me show you some of the stuff that I bought online. Pool goggles, awesome. Water guns, super awesome. And lastly, check this out. It's my very own sea scooter. This cost me $150, so it was almost all of my money, but it's totally worth it. All I have to do is hold on to it and it takes me underwater, like my own personal submarine. I gotta see this baby in action. Let's quietly go to the pool. Going somewhere, Jimmy? Ah, Coach Rocco, what are you doing here? Huh? What is this? Goggles, a sea scooter? Are you on your way to the swimming pool already? Because you know what happens once you step foot outside this bedroom. You go to the challenge! Got it, Coach Rocco. We can't leave the bedroom. Nope, definitely not going to the pool, Coach. Just uh, getting a little fresh air is all. <laughs> There's no way I'm letting Nelly beat me in this challenge. Atta boy, that's the spirit. <laughs> Bloxburg is a great game on Roblox, but I think I'm going to take a break. Let's see what else I have. Whoa, it's my makeup kit. Ooh, I've been waiting for this one. Let's see what's inside. <laughs> it's got blush and lip glosses. Ooh, and on the sides, there's eyeshadows 
and highlighter? Oh, where do I even start? Hmm, I'm gonna take this brush. I'm gonna do a little bit of blush. Time to try out a new look. All done. I love my new look. This calls for a selfie. <gasps> I have a great idea. Jimmy hates it when I put on makeup, so I'm gonna send this selfie to him. <laughs> hey, Jimmy, do you like my makeup? You want me to do yours? <laughs> and set. Oh, hey, I got a text. This must be super important. Hi, Jimmy. Do you like my makeup? Want me to do yours? Ew! Jimmy definitely does not wear makeup. L-O-L, Ellie. You're so funny. Not. <laughs> Send. So it turns out that this sea scooter really isn't that fun if I have to stay up in my room. But luckily, I had lots of other money left over so I could buy more cool stuff. Like this. A tent. I've always wanted to set up a tent in my bedroom. Now's my chance. Uh-oh. This is a little bigger than I thought. I think they sent the wrong tent. Or maybe I should have measured. There we go. So this is what it's like having a tent in your room. This is super awesome. Now I can just sit here in my tent and fly around. Ellie would totally be jealous if she saw me right now. Hey, Ellie! You should check out this awesome tent that I set up in my bedroom. No need for me to leave. I'm gonna be in here all day. You bought a tent? That doesn't make sense. Jimmy, I hope you bought some food as well because you're gonna need it. Oh, I really am so hungry, especially now that I know that Jimmy's being really silly. Oh, but I can't go to the kitchen. So I ordered my lunch, my favorite too. <laughs> Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. And because I usually get really hungry, I got more than one. <laughs> and I even got a drink. Yellow Gatorade matches my shirt. <laughs> hey, Jimmy, I got some extra food if you want some. Peanut butter and jelly? Yeah, right. I know you're just trying to trick me. Nice try, Ellie. But Jimmy was smart enough to buy all of his favorite foods, like chips and chips and more chips. You name it, Jimmy bought it. Uh-oh, though. There's nothing to drink. Oh, did I get anything to drink? Oh, no. All that's left in the box is rope from the tent. What am I going to do? I'm already getting thirsty. Hmm. I need to get to the kitchen to get a drink, but I'm not allowed to leave the room. I got it. What if I tie up the rope inside my room somewhere and then tie the other end of it around my waist? That way, I'll still technically be connected to my room because I'm connected to the rope, which is connected to my room. Now, I know what you're thinking. Jimmy, you're the smartest kid ever. And you're right. Come on, let's go. <laughs> What are you doing outside of your room? Did you give up already? No, I didn't give up. I'm not technically out of my room. You see, one end of this rope is connected to my room and the other end is connected to me, so I'm technically still in my room. <laughs> hmm, that Jimmy, he's always trying to cheat. Wait a minute, this gives me a great idea. <laughs> I did get an arts and crafts set with scissors because I was going to do some crafts later. But I think this is an even better idea. <laughs> ah, I made it to the kitchen. My plan worked, like usual. Wow. 
finally something to drink. Ah, now that's refreshing. Making sure everybody's following the rules by staying in their rooms? Well, well, I can explain. You see, the other end of this rope is connected to my room, so technically I'm still in my room and... Well, it's not anymore. I... That means you left your room. I don't know that happened, Coach Rocco. I swear it was connected to my room. Oh, Ellie, you can come down now. No, 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 Coach, please don't give this badge to Ellie. I'll, I'll stay in my room for two days. Two whole days. That and um, I have a sea scooter if you want it and all the candy you can ever want. Hi. Huh? Well, I just found Jimmy here outside of his room hanging out in the kitchen. So that means you have won the challenge. Here is your 24 hours stay in your bedroom challenge badge. <laughs> Don't be sad, Jimmy. Oh, guess what? I have another PB and J for you and a makeup kit. I'm thinking I'm gonna give you a makeover. How would you like that? That'll make you feel so much better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jimmy. Hey, Sparkle Squad! Guess what? I'm meeting Jimmy and Coach Rocco at the pool today because we're having a race in some giant hamster balls! <laughs> hey, hamsters, are you ready to get inside these balls? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah! All right, today's race is going to be super difficult. You're going to have to take these balls all the way to the top of the hill there and race down. Try to avoid those obstacles there. The first one to make it back here into the pool wins the race. <laughs> Easy. I got this one in the bag. You ready to get inside? Yeah. All right, here goes. One, two, three, go! <laughs> there we go. Now you, Jimmy. My turn. Check this out. GoPro, start recording. Huh. All right, ready? Yep. All right. All right. All right. Get in there. Okay. Awesome. Are we ready, hamsters? Yeah. On your mark. Get set. Go. Oh, 
What's up, Sparkle Squad? <laughs> it's summertime, and it's my favorite time of year because I get to spend all my time off school at Camp Ellie. We have this awesome swimming pool, this giant slip and slide, water balloon slingshots, and we get to stay in this awesome camp house. Come on in, I'll give you a tour inside. The first room I like to show you is the deck or as we like to call it, the game room. And there's a very special someone playing giant dartboard. It's our camp counselor, Coach Rocco. Hi, Coach Rocco. <laughs> Ellie Sparkle's my number one camper. You came just in time. I was about to throw my last dart. If it lands anywhere on that dartboard, I get my highest point yet. <laughs> Here goes. Oh no. Dose. Trez! <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> I got a little excited there. That was so close. Well, good luck, Coach Rocco. I have to get going. I still have a tour to give. <laughs> I have to get you. All right. Luck be a dart tonight. <laughs> All right. Hey, I got it. I died. Look, take a picture. Come on. I hope you're ready for my favorite room in the entire house. As you know, I like to eat a lot. And this is where we keep all the food, the camp kitchen. This is where the yumminess lives, the camp refrigerator. Hit that thumbs up button if you want to get a peek inside and see what kind of food we have at camp. Voila! Wow! Ooh, we have some pickles. Bread, of course, perfect for PB&Js. Gatorade. Even some leftover pizza from last night. I love leftover pizza. And my favorite, cookies. I have a great idea. I'm gonna take this as a snack as I show you around the camp bedrooms upstairs. Awesome. Cool. Hey, Coach Rocco, what are we having for dinner tonight? Today is chicken tacos. Mmm, sounds good. Come on, let's go upstairs. Now's the perfect time for me to tell you about one of my campmates. He's a boy, and he's really nice and all, but he sometimes acts a little silly. Okay, he acts silly all the time, and this is his room. Hello, can I come in? Hey, Ellie. <gasps> there he is. This is my campmate, Jimmy. As you can see, one of his favorite things ever is basketball. Hey, I'm glad you're here. Now check this out. This is my super awesome new basketball move I've been working on. It's called the Jimmy Spinner Rooney. Yes! Actually, I'm the best at pretty much everything here at camp. Here, let me show you some of my badges. I got a pool sports badge and a wilderness one and even an underwater swimming badge. And actually, I have an ice cream eating badge somewhere around here too. Well, let me find it. I'd be here somewhere. Well, I know one badge he doesn't have is the clean room badge. It's really super messy. Come on, I'll show you my room. Come on, come out, come out wherever you are. My room is one of the calmest rooms in the house. Come on, let me show you around. <laughs> This bed is super comfortable, and I decorated my room with all my favorite colors. I have a pink blanket, cool. and pink and yellow pillows. Look, I match. Oh, this is really cool. I have my play buttons. This one I got for getting a million subscribers on my YouTube channel. Isn't that awesome? Wow. And I even have a window that looks out over all the camp activities. I can't wait to show you outside. There's so much more for us to see. <laughs> Welcome to the camp swimming pool. Look, we have a ducky float, a unicorn float, my favorite, and Jimmy's favorite, the hoop and the basketball. <laughs> oh, and this is really cool too. This is a sea scooter. You can use this like your own little mini submarine and go right underwater. Oh. <laughs> 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 okay. 
in the pool. Okay. This is definitely one of the funnest things we have at camp. <laughs> I like to call it a giant bubble. But Jimmy likes to call it a hamster ball. You can use this hamster ball and race across the water or even on the grass. <laughs> hey, Ellie, are you ready for a race in the pool yet? <gasps> You're on. But first, I gotta finish my tour of the camp. <laughs> Come on. I'll hey, meet you up. over there. I this huge yard for all of our camp activities. We've done so much. We've set up tents, we've played sports, we've even played hide and seek. Oh, and the best activity of all, giant slip and slide bowling. I'll show you how to play. You take one of these slides and then you go all the way down. <laughs> and you zoom right into these giant bowling pins. <laughs> Best game ever! <laughs> Showing them uh, Coach Rocco's bowling slip and slide, I see. Mm -hmm. Ellie here has the greatest score all summer. <laughs> Isn't that right, Ellie? Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 hold on. Ellie has the best score? I thought I did. Ellie, what do you say we play a game right now to see who the real best camp bowler is? Well, I guess I showed most of the camp. Fine. All right, challenge accepted. And since I have the highest score, I'll go first. All right, Ellie, you ready for the bowling pin challenge? Yep, I'm All right. ready. One, two, three. Oh! <laughs> She got five. You think you can do that? You bet I can. Here right. comes the new camp bowling champion. <laughs> Are you ready, Jimmy? You bet. Here comes Jimmy. Whoa. Oh, look at that. Jimmy, <laughs> you got... How many did I get? One, two, three, four, five. It's a tie. <laughs> well done. That means you both get the bowling in challenge badges. Wow. Awesome! <gasps> Thank you! Oh my goodness, a tie? I'll take it! Good game, Jimmy. Good game to you too, Ellie. Awesome, a new badge for my collection. This is gonna go great with my underwater badge, and my swimming badge, and my pool sports badge, and my wilderness badge. Hey there, Sparkle Squad! Guess what? I have a secret to tell you. <laughs> I got a new cat. His name is Butters, and he's super cute and cuddly. There were so many pets at the animal shelter, but I wanted this one. Yeah. Hey, did I hear a cat? Oh, hi, Jimmy. Yeah, mm -hmm. me, Butters. Butters is my new cat. <laughs> hey, Butters. You know, I got a new cat, too. I bet Butters would just love him. Oh, awesome. Butters, did you hear that? You're going to have a brother or a sister. <laughs> Let me go get him. Voila! My new kitty! Oh, no. <laughs> Say hi, kitty! I don't think Butters likes her kitty very much. Uh, what's its name? Stinky. Sometimes it gets so stinky that it stinks up the whole house, so Stinky sounds like a good name. I've never seen a cat like that before, Jimmy. I know, isn't his white stripe just the cutest? Aren't you the cutest kitty? Jimmy, I think that's a skunk. A skunk? No mm -hmm. way, really? Ah! Stinky! Oh! Stinky, I told you not to do that anymore. Now I gotta give you a bath. Actually, maybe I better take one first. Bad Stinky, bad Stinky. <laughs> Ugh, Stinky really got me good, P.U. Hey, Jimmy, have you seen Butters around? You see, when your skunk sprayed you, Butters got scared and ran off. And I can't find him anywhere. I've looked all around the house. I hope he didn't go outside. Uh-oh. I'm sorry, Ellie. But don't worry. I'll help you find him. It'll be like a game of hide-and-seek. Let's go. Butters! 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 
I have an idea. All cats love to eat, right? So why don't I go get Butter's food bowl? I bet if we put a little food in it, he'll come right out. That's a great idea, Jimmy. Butters must be really hungry by now. This might actually work. I'll be right back. <sighs> Butters! I'm gonna get your food out, Butters. Just you wait. Where's that cat bowl? Here? No. Nope. Where could it be? Butters? Gotcha. Cat bowl. Check. Where's the food? Hmm. Butters! Aha! Uh -huh. Gotcha! Perfect. Hey, Butters! Oh, hey, Jimmy! Voila! I got something even better than cat food. Cereal. Huh. But, Jimmy, isn't that a little strange? Have you ever seen a cat eat cereal before? No. <laughs> That's funny, Ellie. But everyone knows cats love cereal. It's what I give Stinky every morning. Oh, oh, okay, I guess leave that cereal right there. Ah, Jimmy, I'm gonna go search around the back. Why don't you make some flyers that we can pass out to all our neighbors, okay? Flyers. That's a great idea. Mm -hmm. Ellie, what's this? Somebody left a random bowl of cereal out here. <laughs> Thank goodness I carry around my lucky spoon. <laughs> my lucky day. <laughs> oh. mm -hmm. That hits the spot. Butters! Butters! Come on out, Butters! I sure hope Butters didn't go into the scary wood all by himself. It's too dark and scary for a cute little cat. Come on, Butters, where are you? Hey, Ellie, any luck finding Butters? Nope, no sign of him. Well, don't you worry, because I just finished making the flyers. Once we get these babies up, everyone in the neighborhood will know to look for the cat. That's awesome! Lost cat, if found, return to Ellie Sparkles. That's great! Wait a second. Huh? That's not Butters. That's Stinky. Yeah, about that. I didn't have any pictures of Butters, but I had lots of pictures of Stinky, so I just threw one on there. It's very good to have a picture on the poster. Jimmy, Stinky isn't a cat, remember? He's a skunk. Oh, yeah. Well, he is missing, though. After he sprayed me, he ran off, and I can't find him. Okay, I mean, it's good to get the word out anyways. Why don't you start putting the flyers up, and I have another idea I'm going to do. Sure thing. There's only one thing that Butters likes more than food and cuddles, and that's his cat toys. I have all his favorite toys here, and hopefully I'll lead them from the wood back home, and he'll make his way back. <laughs> Let's start. Butters, consider yourself rescued. Huh. Ellie's so lucky to have a friend like me. I really am the most helpful kid around. favorite toy comes right over here. I sure hope that he finds his way back home. I'm super worried about him. Oh, hi, Jimmy. All done. Perfect. Now let's go inside and wait. I'm getting hungry from all of this looking. Me too. Let's go. Jimmy! Now where did those two get to? What is this? Hey! It's a toy! <laughs> oh, another one! <laughs> oh, oh wow! What is this? Hello, hello! Oh, look at that! <laughs> um, what is this? <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> it's a treasure hunt! Look at all of them! <laughs> Mine! These are all mine! Oh, what is this over here? <laughs> uh, lost cat, if found, return to Ellie Sparkles! <laughs> Let's go look for them! Come on! 
Oh, Jimmy, do you think we'll ever find Butters? I'm just afraid because we've looked everywhere and he may have gotten lost in the woods. Well, don't say that. We haven't looked everywhere. How about the refrigerator? We haven't checked there. Oh, not in the fridge either. I'm sorry, Ellie, it's all my fault. It's okay, Jimmy, I know you never meant it. Did you hear that? A meow. Sounds like it came from the freezer. Butters? Nope. Not the freezer. No, it's not coming from the freezer. I think it's coming from the den. Let's go! Butters? Butters, where are you? Butters? I can hear you. Wait. <laughs> Butters, are you under there? Come on, Butters. Come here. <gasps> oh, there you are, Butters. Oh, I'm so happy I found you again. I'll never lose you ever, 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 okay? I promise. See, what did I tell you? It's like I always say, all cats love cereal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ellie. Jimmy! Hi, Coach Rocco. I came across a missing cat flyer outside, and uh, it brought to my attention that someone is missing a very special kitty. Well, yeah, there was butter. No so we, need uh... to explain, Jimmy. Coach Rocco has taken care of everything, and here is your special friend. Oh, no. <laughs> Stinky! Oh, oh no. no! Run! What? What, what do you mean? I thought you wanted the kitty. Oh, I'll take it. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Naughty, naughty kitty. You don't stay Rocco in the precious, precious face. <laughs> <sighs> smells, smells bad. Naughty kitty. Are you ready to spin the one color challenge wheel? Let's go. <laughs> It landed on orange! Wow, that means I have to wear orange all day and eat orange and drink orange. Wait a second, are you doing the one color challenge? Is it my turn to spin yet? Nice, we can do this challenge together, Jimmy. Yep, go ahead and spin. But remember, we don't do any do-overs. One spin only. Yeah, yeah, no do-overs, I got it. Here comes the biggest spin ever. Jimmy! Come on, keep going, keep going. Nope, it landed on pink. That means you're gonna have to wear, eat, and drink pink all day today, Jimmy. Wait, wait a minute, hold on. That was just a practice one. One more spin. Jimmy! Pink again. There's something wrong with this wheel. Come on, give me one more shot, please. Nope, no do-overs. We're swapping colors for the day. <laughs> Boys and girls, if you wanna see Jimmy wear pink, eat pink, drink pink, give me a big thumbs up. So let me get this straight. I have to wear nothing but pink clothes all day? Yep, that's the challenge. But I don't even own any pink clothes, and I'm pretty sure I've never seen you wear orange either. You know what, that's a good point. I have a great idea. Why don't you go inside my closet and pick out any of the clothes you want? I have plenty of pink, and I'll go into yours because you have plenty of orange. Whoa. So wait a minute. I have to wear your pink clothes? Yes. All right, fine. Challenge accepted. There's no way I'm going to lose this one. So how do I look? Just like Jimmy, right? Orange, 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 orange. <laughs> I can't wait to see Jimmy. Come on out, Jimmy. I want to see ya. No way. I'm not coming out. 
I want to spin the wheel again. No way. No do-overs, remember? Besides, if you don't come out, I guess that means I win the challenge, right? And you'd really want me to win? Oh, fine. I'll come out. Wow! Wow! Jimmy, you look awesome! I love those colors on you. Yeah. I hate it. You're so lucky. You got orange. That's the coolest color there is. I miss my shirt. Hmm. <laughs> you know what? I guess I do look kind of good. I agree. You know what? I think I am going to win this challenge. Hey, Coach Rocco, wait till you see my new pink shirt. No, wait, Coach Rocco, come see my Jimmy costume. Now that we've gotten changed, it's time to freshen up. I need to brush my teeth, but I only have blue toothpaste. Hmm, what else could I use to freshen up my mouth? Well, I have this orange mouthwash. This will do just the trick. <laughs> That's the perfect color. <laughs> Woo! Hmm, minty fresh. Ah, time to brush the old Jimmy Chompers. Wait a second, this toothpaste is white. I'm gonna need pink toothpaste for this challenge. Where's the pink toothpaste? Do we have any? Hey, where do we keep the pink toothpaste? Pink toothpaste? I never heard of it. We got plenty of the white kind though. Wait a second, is that ketchup? Coach Rocco, can I borrow this ketchup? I'll bring it back by lunchtime, I promise. This is gonna be one of my best ideas ever. In art class, we learned that if you combine white with red, it makes pink. So I'll use this red ketchup and this white toothpaste to make pink toothpaste. It's perfect. See, now it's pink. It worked like a charm. Oh, Jimmy, sometimes I amaze myself. Oh, wait. Now I got a brush with toothpaste and ketchup? Oh, I don't know if I can do this. Oh, you want to win the challenge, don't you? Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. Come on, Jimmy. Three, two, one, go! Oh, gross. Good news, Jimmy. I found a tube of pink toothpaste. Ellie found it. <laughs> What? I've already been brushing with this dog. <laughs> All right, it's time for our favorite time of the day, lunchtime. Finally, I've had a pretty tough day so far, but once I have a delicious lunch, I'll finally have the energy I need to beat you in the challenge. Welcome to lunch. Now, I know you two have been doing this special one color challenge all day, so I made you both a very special lunch. Ooh. Ellie, you first. Wow. This I like to call the orange plate. We've got oranges, we've got mango, we've got carrots, and we even got a little bit of pumpkin in there. <laughs> Enjoy. It looks delicious and super healthy and orange. Coach Rocco, what about my lunch? For you, this. Awesome. I knew you'd save me, Coach. A strawberry milkshake, one of my favorites. Uh, uh, close. I like to call it the Pink Rocco Smoothie. <laughs> you see, it was really difficult to find things that were pink to put into that. So I put in a little bit of watermelon, some beets, some fish, and then I put in some salmon. And then I couldn't find anything that was pink, so I put in more salmon and then some more salmon on top of that. <laughs> yeah. So this is essentially a fish and beet milkshake? Yeah, it's good. All right, well, you know, I did just brush my teeth with ketchup, so this should be a breeze. Come on, Jimmy, you want to win the challenge, don't you? Love out of here, Ellie, you win. Jimmy! Ugh. Hey, I win? Awesome, I'm gonna finish this orange plate. It's so good. 
And I don't like to see that uh, the pink Rocco smoothie just sitting there not getting drink. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> I made it, I should love it, right? <laughs> Ugh. Are you okay, Coach Rocco? No, it's a... Coach Rocco? No, no. Delicious. <laughs> what? So, why are you drinking it? Coach Rocco? Are you ready to spin the DIY Halloween costume wheel? Let's go! Cool! It landed on the mummy. That means we're going to make Coach Rocco a mummy costume. Coach Rocco's been a little sad lately because he doesn't have a Halloween costume ready this year. <laughs> but don't worry, we're going to cheer him up. The only rule of this game is we have to use supplies that we already have. No going to the store for us. Boys and girls, if you know what to use to make a mummy costume, give me a big thumbs up. I think you know what I'm thinking. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, hi, Jimmy. I'm going to need a lot of toilet paper. Do you know where it's all kept? I sure do. But first, what do you need it for? I can't just give you all that toilet paper for nothing. You see, I'm playing this game where I'm making DIY Halloween costumes, and I'm doing a mummy. Oh, awesome. I'll help you out. Coach Rocco keeps all the toilet paper upstairs in the closet. I'll go get it. Awesome. While Jimmy's doing that, I'm going to go to the bathroom and see if there's any extra toilet paper. Toilet paper, where are you? Oh, <laughs> got one. Huh. But this is definitely not enough for a full costume. I wonder how Jimmy's doing. Jimmy, how's it going up there? Coming. Wait till you see how much toilet paper I got. We'll have enough to make mummy costumes for everyone in school. Ellie? Jimmy? Uh-oh. Okay, Coach Rocco, are you ready to get your Halloween costume on? All you have to do is pose like this. Wait, where did you get all this toilet paper? Did you get into the closet again, Jimmy? Sorry, but everyone knows that mummies don't talk. This is going to be totally worth it. Boys and girls, if you want to see me and Jimmy wrap up Coach Rocco like a mummy, give us a big thumbs up. Are you ready? One, two, three, go! Let's do this. Pretty good, right, Jimmy? Yeah. I think we are done. Awesome. How do you like your costume, Coach Rocco? You're what? a mummy now. Like it? I love it. Look at my mummy walk. <laughs> Look at Coach Rocco. Look at Rocco. Look at Rocco. <laughs> I'm a professional doggy pet. Oh, I got it. <laughs> You're going to wrap me again. I am going to go trick or treating tonight. <laughs> <laughs> now that Coach Rocco's costume is all done, it's time to spin the wheel again and see what I wear. Let's do this. It landed on the witch costume. I've always wanted to dress up as a spooky witch. Let's go find the supplies in the house. Oh, I definitely got this one. I have all the supplies you need to be a witch right over there in the barn. I'll go get them. Wait, Jimmy! The barn? <sighs> ah, the barn. This should have everything I need. Let's see. Hmm. <coughs> this looks like something a witch would wear. Let's see, what else do witches wear? I need a hat. Perfect. All right, and uh, a broomstick. Witches always have broomsticks. Hmm, a baseball bat? Close enough. I told you this would be easy. Gosh, I wonder where Jimmy went off to. Here you go, Ellie. I got everything you'll need for your witch costume. Awesome! A cape? This looks perfect. I found it behind the barn door. 
Ooh, spooky. Ta-da! And secondly, all witches wear hats, right? Well, this was the only hat I could find, so here you go. I mean, I guess I could be a cowboy witch. Those exist, right? And last but not least, a bat. Witches love bats, I figure. And plus, this one doubles as a broom. Oh, I see what you did there, Jimmy. I don't know, boys and girls. Do you think I look like a witch to you? No! Wait, 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 hold on. Is it a better broom you're looking for? Because you could attach this to the end of the bat and oh. see, that looks like, it looks perfect. I mean, I, I guess so, but I don't know. I've never seen a baseball bat broomstick before. Oh, no, it looks great. Trust me, you're ready Maybe to go trick or treating. Maybe on this side, I don't know. Time to spin the wheel again and try another costume. One, two, three, go! It's a pirate costume! Oh, awesome! You'd make such a great pirate. I have everything you need for your costume right there in the barn. Uh, Jimmy, I actually think the pirate costume is for you. And I think I have the perfect supplies for you inside. Let's go! Look, Jimmy, I found one of Coach Rocco's favorite jackets. I'm sure he wouldn't miss it too much. Try it on. It looks super piratey. Wow. I feel like a pirate already. Oh, but you're not a pirate yet. You gotta have a hook. And I think this hanger will do just the trick. All you have to do is bend it into shape. And look, you have a hook already. Huh, a homemade hook. This is so cool. Arrgh. <laughs> okay, I think that we have to make some accessories. Come over here. Because we're going to make a pirate hat. For a pirate hat, you're going to need black construction paper, a stapler, and scissors. It's that easy. Here we go, the finished pirate hat. Doesn't it look good? Yes. But we're missing one more accessory. The pirate's eye patch. I wonder what we can use to make one of those. Oh, an, an eye patch, you say? You mean like uh, mm. this one that I found in the barn? Told you I could find anything in there. Jimmy, you're so good at finding things. Why don't you put that on and I'll put on your hat for you. This is gonna be the best pirate costume ever. Mm. Ah. Here we go. Oh, perfect fit. <laughs> This is so cool. I'm Jimmy Beard the Pirate. Arr! <laughs> you look really good. Quick, I need your help. I can't get out of this costume and I have to go to the bathroom really bad. Uh, Mr. Pirate, why don't you use that hook to help me get this toilet paper off me? Captain Jimmy to the rescue. Just hook it right there and I'll spin out. Ready? Go! <laughs> I'm all right. I, I landed on a soft spot, okay. <laughs> Don't worry about me. Hi, boys and girls. I'm at the dentist for a checkup to make sure I don't have any cavities. How's it looking there, Coach Rocco? I mean, Dentist Rocco? Up, oh, it's looking good so far, but hopefully you didn't eat too much Halloween candy like Jimmy does every year. Mmm, yum. Well, let's keep looking. All right, I'm just gonna look over here. That's looking good. How about this one over here? That one looks good. Uh, yeah, that looks good too. Up, uh, looking good, looking good. Congratulations, Ellie. You have no cavities. Looks like you've been brushing and flossing every day. Yep. Twice a day, once in the morning and once at night. Okay, Jimmy, now it's your turn. Uh, well, here's the thing. I already brushed my teeth this morning, so I don't need a checkup. Come on, let's go to class. Oh. Uh, don't be silly, Jimmy. Now, come on, this won't hurt a bit. You don't have to be scared. Scared? Me? This is Jimmy you're talking to, the bravest boy in class. Plus, I brought Mr. Fluffy for support. <laughs> Scared. I'll show you who's scared. All right, let's have a look. Oh, what is that tool you're using? 
On second thought, I'm out of here. Come on, Mr. Fluffy. Wait, Jimmy, I wasn't done. He's always running away. This happens every year at Jimmy's checkup, but don't worry. He left his Halloween candy here. We can use it to lure him back. Jimmy's gonna get his checkup whether or not he wants to or not. <laughs> <laughs> if you wanna help find Jimmy, hit that thumbs up button. Let's go, turn to Rocco. Jimmy, come out, come out, wherever you are. Jimmy, I have your Halloween candy here. If you come out and do your checkup, you can have all your Halloween candy back. Jimmy? Coming through, coming through. I have the perfect plan to catch Jimmy. What do you think? Whoa, a giant beach ball? No, it's a giant hamster ball. I went ahead and put Jimmy's Halloween candy inside. See it right there. And when he comes by to get it, we'll hide and then we'll sneak up and wham, we got him. <laughs> what do you think? Well, Jimmy would do anything for his Halloween candy, so I think this is a great idea. Come on, let's go hide. Come on, this way. <laughs> This is gonna be so easy. I'm like the best hide and seek player in the whole world. Ellie and dentist Rocco don't stand a chance. <gasps> hey, look at that. Mm -hmm. It looks like a giant hamster ball. <gasps> oh, he's coming. It is a giant hamster ball. <gasps> and hey, look, some of my candy's inside too. This must be my lucky day. <laughs> get him, get him, get him. Gotcha, Jimmy. Jimmy. <laughs> Oh, Ellie and Dentist Rocco. <laughs> oh, I guess you got me. This is a great plan, Coach Rocco. Jimmy would do anything for his candy. Yep, now we just gotta pump you up and get you back to the dentist's office. Come on. And just one more pump, Jimmy, and I'll sit. <laughs> awesome. This way to the office, Jimmy. Come on. <laughs> right this way. That was some great teamwork, Dr. Rocco. Wait a second, I have an idea. <laughs> Usually so hard to get. Jimmy! 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 Jimmy, get back here! You can't catch me. I'm hey. dead! Oh. 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 Coach! I mean dentist! I, yes! Jimmy! Keep going! Don't worry about me! Wahaha! <laughs> Jimmy escapes again. They have no shot of finding me. No dentist appointment for Jimmy this year. To celebrate, I'm gonna take a nice, relaxing dip in the pool. Whoa. Hey, wait a second. Is that more candy? Wow, this really is my lucky day. Not only do I not have to go to my dentist appointment, but I get to eat the rest of my candy, too. Yes. Let's dive in and get it. Here comes Jimmy. <laughs> Got it. Ah. Jimmy, come on out of the pool. You can play hide and seek all day after your checkup. All right, fine. I just need you to help me out. All right, here, grab hold of this toothbrush. Yeah. Careful, Coach Rocco. Mm. Closer. Now, Jimmy, get closer to me. Wait, you. Uh, no. Jimmy! Jimmy, Jimmy! Jimmy. Oh. Ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> well, then, Ellie. Oh, wait. This, this also doubles as a flotation device. Oh, great! Oh, so, oh, good. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh Coach. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, Coach. Oh. Don't fall in. Why does this keep happening to me? <laughs> Couldn't catch me at school, or in the hamster ball, or even in the pool. <laughs> I'm the best at hiding. You know, sometimes even I forget how awesome I am. And speaking of, here comes the Jimmy Spinneroony. Whoa! Did I make it? Yes! And the crowd goes wild. Jimmy, 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 Jimmy! Oh no, Ellie and Dentist Rocco. Wait, uh, you want me to teach you how to do the Jimmy Spinneroony? Nope, Jimmy, we finally caught you. And it's time for you to get your checkup. Once and for all. Oh, fine. I ate all my Halloween candy anyway. So I probably have a lot of cavities. Let's just get this over with. All right, let's have a look-see. Now what's this over here? Oh, looks like you got a little, uh... 
Halloween candy stuck up there. Not too good. Uh, what's this over here? Oh, need to floss that later. Uh-huh. Oh, looks like you got an old uh, gummy bear stuck between those teeth there. What's this over here? Over here, uh-huh, looking good. Little gummy bear right there. There we go, look at that. Looking good. Well, guess what, Jimmy? You've got no cavities. No cavities? Awesome. The old Jimmy Chompers are back in business. Better than ever. <laughs> I told you, Jimmy. Checkups aren't so bad after all. <laughs> yes! Well, when you're a big boy like me, they're pretty easy. And especially now that I'm done, I get to do another ah! terrific Jimmy <laughs> Spinneroli. Oh. Jimmy! <laughs> I think I broke my tooth. Oh, oh Jimmy. No, Jimmy. Hey, Sparkle Squad. <sighs> Today we're gonna hit the pool. And Camp Counselor Coach Rocco told us to make these giant shapes. But they're a lot heavier than I thought. I'm definitely gonna need some help. Oh, hey, Jimmy. You wanna help me carry this giant shape over to the pool? Sure thing. My name is Jimmy, you know, the strongest kid in camp. This will be a breeze. <sighs> I wonder what these giant shapes are for. Hey, do you hear that? It sounds like the ice cream truck. Oh, ice cream? Um, why don't we go get a cone after our camp activity today, Jimmy? <laughs> oh, after our camp activity? But I want it now. I can't wait. Ice cream. Jimmy! Hold on. No! <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to carry this all by myself. <laughs> Today's challenge is jumping through impossible shapes. The rules are simple. We're going to take these shapes that you made and put them into the pool. Then each of you are gonna jump into the pool and through the shape. The one who jumps through the shape and doesn't touch the board gets a point. But if you touch the board, you get zero. Now we're gonna use this wheel to pick which shape we use first. Ready? One, two, three, spin the wheel! <laughs> yes, it landed on circle. Well, here's the circle. Ellie, would you do the honor and throw it into the pool? My pleasure, Coach Rocco. So I have to jump into the circle without touching the sides of it. I think this is going to be pretty easy, don't you? <laughs> I have my GoPro just in case I want to see what it looks like when I jump in. Hi! Ooh, it's going to look so cool. And I got my goggles. Let's put them on. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> Jimmy, over here, coach. This challenge is super easy, so that's why I'm gonna make it awesome with my favorite donut floaty. It's a perfect circle, so it'll fit right through the board. Ready or not, here comes Jimmy. Jimmy. Did I do it? Did I do it? Did I win? Oh no, Jimmy, you didn't make it through. That crack you heard oh. was you crashing through the board. You didn't make it through at all. Wait a minute, I didn't make it through? Hold on, I get a do-over. Just let me get my donut. Oh, look at this, Jimmy. Okay, and the score for round one is one Ellie, Jimmy zero. And now it's time for round two. And spin the wheel! <laughs> it landed on the person! Oh, wait till you see this one. This one's my personal favorite. <laughs> A person? 
It looks like he's sleeping. How are we supposed to jump through this if he's sleeping? Good throw. Jimmy's definitely got this one. I just gotta jump in there like I'm jumping into bed. Here comes Jimmy. I definitely got it this time, right? You did it, Jimmy! You jumped right through without touching the board! Great job! That was amazing! Awesome! <laughs> this was the hardest jump ever, and Jimmy got it! Woo! Nice jump, Jimmy! Now let's see if I can get through without touching the sides. This is gonna be a hard one! One, two, three, go! Ah! you touch the board, that means no points for you. But that does mean that you and Jimmy are now tied! Ooh, I love a good competitive challenge! <laughs> and now it's time for round three. Ellie has one, Jimmy has one. The score is tied. Now let's spin the wheel! <laughs> Wow, it landed on the letter B. We have to jump through shapes and letters. Yup, and here it is. Lucky for me, this is what my name starts with. Oh, I'm totally going to win this one. Jimmy, your name starts with a J, not B, remember? J, Jimmy. J, B, what's the difference? Either way, I'm totally going to win. <laughs> yeah. This is a tricky one. I'm gonna have to pick which loop I'm gonna have to jump through. I can pick the nearest one or the furthest one. I think I'm gonna pick the furthest one. I'm feeling extra jumpy today. Three, two, one. you could do the same? Ellie only jumped through one of the loops in the B. That's like cheating. I'm gonna jump through both loops and that'll show you who the real best jumper is. Here comes <laughs> Jimmy! <laughs> Jimmy! Jimmy! Did you see that? I got through both loops! Best jumper ever! Uh, I don't think so, Jimmy. Look how the board is all busted up. The whole challenge is, is about not touching the board. I'm afraid you don't get a point for this one. I'm not allowed to touch the board? Nobody told me that. That's not fair. I thought it was better if you touched the board. Oh, come on, give me a do-over. Let me go one more time, Coach, please. Not fair. And the score is now two Ellie, one Jimmy. It's time for round four. And spin the wheel! <gasps> awesome! It landed on the heart shape. That's my favorite shape of all time. A oh, heart? <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> Give me that. Favorite shape? Check. Jump and stretch. Check. Time for me to go. One, two, three. Oh, look at that perfect jump. <laughs> okay, pressure's on, Jimmy, but you can't get through. Please, heart shape is easy peasy. All I gotta do is turn myself into a heart shape. Ready or not, here comes Jimmy. Oh. Ah! Jimmy. Oh. Jimmy. Oh. Ah! Jimmy. I did it, world pool jumping champion. <laughs> I'm afraid not 
Jimmy, you busted up the board yet again. That means Ellie has three points and you have one point, making Ellie the pool jumper challenger winner! Yes! Third in the pool, coach! And there you go, there you go. Oh. Oh. Right behind you, Mr. Oh, there it is. Got it! <laughs> no Jimmy. Fair. Oh my goodness, you really messed up that board good, huh? Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Give me one more try. I'll get it this time, I swear. <laughs> You're a real heartbreaker. Three, two, Jimmy. one. Ah! Yeah, <laughs> no, Did I get it, it this time? No. <laughs>